ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> boys and girls, children of all ages. We are joined right now by that one, that Pittsburgh Steelers alumni. I'm talking about the one, that West Virginia Mountaineer alumni. Now they say it's almost heaven over there. Now, almost now, heaven. now, now I'm talking almost. about, I'm talking about my locker mate, but he's one half of the mother freaking locker mates, baby. I'm talking about yeah. Terrence Golvin, aka TG. Oh, oh, yeah. oh my yeah, god! Oh yeah, my god! Yeah, yeah. We love him. We love him. Yeah. We there it is. There it go. There it go. They there shouting go, you out. Stand clear. It's, showing it's, you it's love. A two A style. Showing you love. I'm telling the you. The interest is growing. Listen, bro. They all it. Tito with the good vibes. He RQ queuing for you, bro. Yeah, Everybody bro, man, showing you love over vibe, here, bro. Man. They got the doggy Dark emojis enough. in here. It's 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 active. All right. Woo, 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 woo. It's real bark, active bark, right bark, now. Bark, it's real active right now. That's all yeah. I'm saying, bro. The chat yeah. get turned up when you pull up, man. They say, they say, okay. TG, roll up. All right. They, hey, DC53, you know he on one. You know we all ready to go Come today. On. Come on, bro. I got, you know what I mean? It's the all vibe out here, bro. You know, say smoke, I'm popping up. This, you know it's what the mean? vibe out here, baby. You know what time it's it is, man. We know what time it is. Here, man. Feel good. Hey, look, man. Good. The season's it's here now, huh? Yeah, it yeah. smells good. It feels good. Look good, it's football season again, man. What a time. Heck yeah, it's man. Most, Heck most yeah. Wonderful time of the year, man. You know? Absolutely, bro. Absolutely. And with that being the case, man, we just gonna throw you right into the middle of the convo. They said that Brandon Ayuk was in a white shirt and black shorts today at practice really? for the Niners. Okay. But yesterday, yeah. what was he wearing? Did he, did he have 49ers? He had 49ers yeah. gear on yesterday. In red. And yeah. in red, all right? So yeah. we know your boy ABCTESPN, direct source was Brandon Ayuk. He said that, man, that dude is up out of there, right? Then we see yeah, yeah, the yeah. GOAT receiver, Jerry Rice, say, deal in place for him to stay, deal in place yeah. for him to get traded. Ayuk, what's it going to be? We haven't yes. had any answers since then. What's your thoughts on the scenario, baby? Uh, I told you, I think Brandon Ayuk will stay a 49er man mm. i just think they like i just think all that you got all that i don't want to say hometown in his ear but like all that hometowns in his ear they're like bro you're gonna get your money you're gonna get it you're gonna get it take this bag and then go get your money you know mm -hmm. let's do this one more I, I just feel like like i said all that hometowns in his ear even the jerry rice that you speak of and what's in there bro yeah i just think all that hometown is in his ear you know yeah. And it's kind of like it seemed like I've never seen nothing like this this strong, but it seems like it's really up to him. Like Low what key, you want to do? Deep, That's what we were saying. He literally just said, that. "He's like, I'm, bro, I'm I'm getting tired of it. He needs to make a decision yeah. at this point." And I feel like it's just getting pushed and pushed to where it's like, man, that's up to you, man. What you trying to do? We'll give you this. You can get this, or you can go up there and meet some new friends, yeah. and you'll get that. You know? And it's like. I don't. I think. I think he's lost his power a little bit because now it's kind of like, man. I don't know if I'm giving him all that. Like, <laughs> hey, we'll give you. I give you 26. Now it seems like that's the number. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like 27 or, you know, whatever. So it's like, um, I just personally, I just think he's gonna be where he's at personally. But you know, I love to see that weapon. That's a weapon. That, that's a that's you? a major weapon, that's bro. Weapon. It's a major that's weapon. A weapon. But. You know, might not happen. So the next part of this thing is this, man. Um, We know, obviously, the chat has been very loud about the Pittsburgh Steelers having interest in Brandon Ayuk, and that hasn't changed. But Jerry right. Dulac, we know, covers the Steelers, man, has a lot of his uh, reports and information out there. He said that the Steelers said that regardless of this Ayuk situation, they view George Pickens as a franchise receiver and they're going to pay right. him accordingly. I totally agree with that. So how I mean I think how can both of I those think, things be accurate if you bring in an Ayuk though? I think GP is a guy, you know what I mean? You gotta yeah. put that in the air right now. You always gotta love home. Okay. You know what I mean? <laughs> Which I agree. You gotta love home. Keep, keep it happy yeah. while you looking. Okay. Yeah. You don't mess with home till home's done. <laughs> yeah. you know I mean? My, Cause I'm like we we window shopping hard right now, but we like yo don't trip. I, I still love you. You still the real one. You the main thing, but we window shopping heavy yeah, right we, now, so bro. We got our eyes in different places. Yeah, yeah. We, we, what's the what's the little meme? We, we holding GP's hand and we eyeballing the heck out out young know, young Brandon Ayuk man. Yeah, 
what? Come on, like, bro. That's like what we that. on right now. Like, hey, I, I'm going to get in, though. Like, like, I ain't, I ain't Teams have pulled like that off, though. Over there, Eagles. <laughs> Devonta no, Smith, AJ Brown. Yeah. But I like how that look over there. Who else like, got two receivers geez. like that? They're paying like that. It could be the 49ers if they end up paying IU. It could be yeah, him yeah. and Debo. Yeah. Yeah, I, I mean it's 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 doable. I don't know how the Eagles, you know, talk about know cap situation. Yeah, I mean talking about cap situation. How do they do like, it? Yeah. How are the Niners paying all these dudes? The Eagles. How do they have these top two receivers? They're paying Jalen Hurts. They got a defense, but they got a drafted defense though versus a paid for. Yeah. Like they're not the a ton Eagles of like second young, contract guys. They're young. Yeah. We got more the second contract paying, guys. They really not paying all them dudes. Like all that D line, not really getting they're young, paid. Yeah, that's like a, the linebackers that's are young. Secondary get a couple yeah. little pieces. Slay's really the only respect. piece, then, right? right. Bradbury, he didn't even break the Frank, bank either. Yeah, when he left, Slay didn't break the bank. Like mm. Slay's not top five in the corner room, yeah. corner thing. But it's the San Fran. Whatever they do, I they, don't know how they, they do it, bro. Top. Yeah, they got the cheat Man, code. They pay everybody, and, and it's like, like top five at your position paid. Like, yeah, bro. As much as we joke and we talk, everybody talks the IU. What is going on with Trent Williams? Like, isn't he still angry over Trent there? Trent said, exactly. bro, y'all better break the bank for me. And if you see him, friend, it's not even a debate. You're paying Trent before you pay IU, bro. You got to. And these, these kids got, got egos, man. Got like, not to, to say kids, but these, these men got egos. Hey, I'm about to say, man, like, you can't call them kids out here, bro. They get upset about that, man. Put some respect on their name, bro. Yeah. It's, like, it's like, oh, I'm not top five. I don't want that. Yeah. Like, what? Like, they want to see money. top five or highest paid at their position. Yeah. Like, that's what it like is. Like, highest paid ever. Yeah. Like, they want that title, man. Uh -huh. I was the highest paid tackle ever for 20 minutes. Like, yeah. you know, so respect and respect. I would, too. I, I feel that. I'm not mad at it. I'm just saying, like, it's a lot. But I guess what Moats is saying, if if we got Ayuk and we plan on paying Pickens, say Pickens is a good year, we plan on paying him, what do you think our plan is that, Quarterback, or even Man. just divvying up this other money. <laughs> if we go give, we just gonna that's figure a, it out. We just gonna. Look, we, I think we gotta trust Con. Maybe that's what uh, it comes down to. take thirty GP. Deke say GP got to get more than Ayuk. GP if he balls out, than... yeah. If he balls okay, out. Okay, so that's if Ayuk is good. coming in at twenty eight, thirty mil, what are we talking about, bro? <laughs> but I think GP is gonna get his no matter what. I just think they. I just think that's a quarterback situation. You know what I mean? Yeah, because like, we still gotta pay a quarterback in a year or draft yeah. something, right? But I think that's the whole reason of the Justin Fields right now. Like, man, don't you love it here? Don't you love it? Don't, <laughs> don't you want to stay it? for the cheat? Come on, bro. Yeah. Don't you love it? You see how we talk to you? You see how we treat you? Don't you love it? Don't you love it? Hey, now, you know now, I mean? you know, we're going to talk to you about Justin Fields in a little bit, too. We ain't, we ain't there just yet, though, all right? But, you know, we're going to bring that up to you in a second. Don't you love it? You love it here. We take care of you. We love you. Don't you love it? You know? I think that's what we say. That's what the story is saying. So it's like, it's a game within the game happening for sure. You know, yeah. they're already on their next year thought patterns with this year. Oh, you got to be. You got to be. Yeah. So, I mean, and I think not even to go there, but I think because you said something heavy, you need to repeat. And if you're talking about bringing in Ayud over here, you're saying you're going to pay a GP. I think that totally says Russ is your starting quarterback because it's like, ooh, uh -huh. I can't have this go too crazy, uh -huh. and I got to get ready to pay that. Because uh, Phil could I'm, do something stupid with that. Yeah. You Whereas with Russ, Russ is older, so you know you can cap what I got to pay you because of your age. <laughs> I don't care what you say, D. I'm not going to break the bank on you at 37 years old. No, not. That's not happening. But if I'm you're Justin Fields that. and you're 25, 26, ooh. That's a way hey. different conversation. Yeah, that's, that's a, a different way different conversation. You also forgot about the draft pick. If Fields plays a certain amount of snaps, that draft pick we're giving the Bears goes from a sixth to a fourth. And we don't care about that little pick. But I, you can have yeah, that I pick. don't care about the fourth. Yeah, I don't care about that's that. A first, that's a first-round talent. Yeah. Like, hold on, hold on. Okay. I'm, I'm just saying, I'm throwing it in the mix, too, it's, it's, to what you guys if, are talking if about. If the QB can prove that it's the QB, you don't care about that pick. You want the proven QB. Yeah. yeah, I want the one we know. Yeah. Not the one but, I what don't. you guys are saying is like you don't want Fields to showcase his talent to, to, to the greatest extent. We're, we're, we're trying to have our cake. And we don't want to have to pay him fifty million next year. We're we trying to have yeah. our cake. And I mean, that's too. real though. Yeah, that's what we trying that's to real do. Though. I can't. I can't let it do too much. Yeah, because if it's too loud, now you messing up my plan. I can't have yeah. my plan messed up. No, that'd be a good problem. I would just trade one of the receivers. To me, yeah. Because you, you the name of the game is finding the quarterback. Me and Mus were just yeah, talking about that. You want one of those top ten guys. 
You do. You definitely do. But you want him at the stake of having talent around him, too. Yes, because though. if you, you have know? him and nothing else, then it's just like, yo, go be the hero until you can't be. And if you turn the ball over a lot, we're going to crucify you. But go be the hero each and every week. And it's fine. But eventually, man, it catches up. Pat Mahomes, Pat Mahomes is Superman. Uh-huh. But it's kind of like they don't pay nothing else than that. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? But they, they got the coming. right, they got the exact right amount of pieces around it, though. Kelsey, yeah. they run that ball well enough, and everything else is go be Superman. Oh, yeah, that's just how good Mahomes yeah, is. Yeah, go be Superman. Yeah, if you got one of those guys, and the Bills are trying it out this year with Allen. Yeah, but even a, with a bunch that, of talented it's guys, like, not wide receiver one, yeah, though. Yeah, and it might like work. It still works with Mahomes. It's, it's challenges to that, though, because once it's again, challenging. if Mahomes doesn't play perfect, if he's not great every single time out, what are the Chiefs, bro? And it, it's not going to work. That's a tough way to live in this league, man. Hey, and that's, that's a tough, tough way to what happens with Jordan Love. He's got a similar scenario. Yeah, it does, yeah. Bunch of, like, wide receiver twos up there. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like we and he's like a guy. That. That's what I mean. He's a guy. Yeah. So once you find – and I don't think Fields is that just now, yet. Tell me, that's you why said Jordan Love's a guy, but you, don't, you, you still don't like Dak Prescott as a nope, guy. That's still nope, crazy nope, to me, bro. I get nope. you, though. I get you. That's still crazy to me. <laughs> Jordan, Jordan Love is – no, 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 TG. Hold on, hold on, hold on, TG. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Jordan Love is a guy to you off of eight games, but Dak is not a guy. I want to give Jordan Love everything. No, 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 no. But, 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 TG, you see, you, you weren't on this call earlier. We was having this convo about if the Steelers had to choose next year between drafting a quarterback or going to pay Dak Prescott if the Cowboys allowed him to walk, which one would you do? I was leaning which on one? going to get Dak because I'm saying, man, this is I'll already proven. That. It's proven. It's going to cost, but it's proven. Are he throws for 4K million? and he throws 40 tighties a 55, year. 55, 60 million. It's pro- right. But that's the market. I can't do it. But that's when I'm looking at what Tua, when I look at Trevor Lawrence, when I look at all these quarterbacks and what they're making, I'm telling myself, I know this is proven, but the option is, would you go get something in the draft? So when he we, says that Jordan about, Love, he he says Shador of, of all names. So he said, so <laughs> what's saying, Green Bay? Or no, Dallas. he's saying for, no, he's saying for uh, us in Pittsburgh. He's saying, I'm just yo, saying he I'd rather, rather I'd rather take a risk of drafting a, a guy because I well, than us going to get Dak. I'm next not year against if that Dak, but I'm not gonna pay Dak sixty million. I'd pay Dak what like Baker's getting like thirty five or something like average money, but he's not gonna take that because I think that's what that's I, worth I, to me. I think you always gotta go with the proven factor, you know what I mean? Because it's proven, like you've seen it, you know what it is, you know what that is. You know? I said, but we just drafted a quarterback in the first round two years ago. We've we've done this part of the experiment where that. it doesn't work. But Justin I, Fields, the first I, rounder, I, he's here right now. Proven. Yeah, I think that. But and you saying Shador? I don't know if we're just talking about him specifically. Hey, just but just, just drafting a quarterback. Yeah, just, there's just, whoever. Yeah. Cause I'm like that's your door is gonna be a loud movie too. Like that ain't that's gonna be that's wow, gonna wow, be a bro. lot. Yeah, I think, I think he's the only quarterback that I know in this upcoming draft. Yeah, I guess him and Carson be Beck. This shit my door is that boy Carson bro, Beck, that's, that's the door. That's shit door is an IMAX. That's yeah. IMAX, Dolby Digital, Eddie nah. Strauss. Yeah, that might be bro. louder than Caleb type. All right, like, that's, that's what I'm trying to tell you, bro. Wild. You know his daddy is too, right? Yeah, we we've what seen this mean? story. We've seen this story right. playing for a while now. Hey, <laughs> you see pops like we're choosing our team. We're going to like, <laughs> listen. That, they they said they they were talking today. They said could it be a scenario where prime time goes and coaches the Cowboys if they are bad enough to get right. should do in the first? I was I like, oh. This is crazy. That's how they talk about the Shador vibe, bro. So yeah, that's gonna be loud, loud. loud I would. Loud, I'd, loud. I'd probably. I'd take yeah. my chance drafting him over bringing him to Dak. That's tough to me, but I get because I, I don't. I, I don't think saying, Dak's though. a guy. I think he's he's capped. Like we know what he is. But I think he's capped I as think, a four thousand and forty touchdown dude, though. Dude. I was gonna say Dak's just been a cow and one play. That's yeah. why he won two plus. And the Cowboys are very loud, like, also. Dak's an elite. Dak's a really good quarterback. Bro. See, he, he don't like count. when I say that though. He he not hearing no. that. I've been saying that he's like, nah. I want a Dak guy that can like elevate that, a team and go toe to toe with some of these other AFC quarterbacks. I don't think Dak can do that. <laughs> Man, Dak's just a quarterback, so you this know, is crazy, him for, bro. You know him for that, like. But Dak's a guy. You know what I mean? Like he's Dak's good. not no. Ain't nothing to be played with. That's why I'm like, yo, Dak. He low key nice. For he 60 just million? he just hasn't won the Super Bowl or had the moment that run just yet. But it's like, yo, every year, the prerequisite to the postseason, he's dominating that stuff. Man, you got to think them boys was number one in everything last like, year, wasn't they? come on, bro, yeah. <laughs> like, for a lot of quarterbacks, it's like, oh, yeah, that's, 
Like, and then I Jordan like Love this. dismantled. But but think about this though. You lose to Jordan Love. You yeah. said Jordan Love is nice though, right? Yeah. So that's an indictment on Dak because Jordan Love is nice. If Justin Fields uh, does what Dak did last no, year, no, not necessarily. Like it's back. just Dak is what he is to me. Like I, Bro, I think Jordan Justin Love's better. Fields, if Justin Fields. Does what Dak did last year. Justin Fields will break the bank. So. That's a fact. He would get 60 somewhere if he gave us a year that Dak just gave you last year. For a fact, he would. Yeah. Yeah. They want to try to. They would you, hold on, hold on. But, but, but time out, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. If that did happen, Deke, would you pay Fields 60 million? Oh, man. If Fields gave you a Russ type season, well, you're, and you're would you give the, him 60? You're, you're telling me the playoffs go like the playoffs went for Dak? Yeah, it's a Dak type season. Excuse me, I, I said Russ. I mean, it's a Dak season. Oh, it's Dak. Man. Dak. Dak was an MVP finalist, and he lost in the first round. But he lost to Jordan Love, though. So hey, you lose to Josh Allen. All right, cool. That's tough, man. That's tough. I, maybe you do just because you think Fields has more of a ceiling here. <laughs> this like there's, crazy, there's still, bro, there's still more out there with Fields, and it, it, the conversation what? goes hand in hand with like a guy like Trevor Lawrence or even like a Jordan Love. Like there's still so much more left out there. Dak. Dak has already proven so much capped. more too, though. It's over. It's Dak over has already done this a couple times now. He's on the back end. The back. It's the, it's done with him. He's on the he's, back end. He's deep. not getting any better. Oh he's man, this we know hurts what Dak me, is. man. We know what Dak is. We know what a two is. This that's hurts, it. They're, man. they're capped. And that's fine. They can be good quarterbacks. Two, they're like two. Alex Smith. Uh, bro, no. I feel like two. So, so. I'll give you Dak's over. I'll give you Dak over and Alex Smith. I, like, I'll give you that. But the, it's it's all in the same boat to me. And then if you're paying a Dak like $60 million, it's just it's just crazy. That's, TG, you don't have Dak and Kirk Cousins in the same boat. <sighs> They, they kind of in the same boat to me though. Like that's so that's what I'm saying. I don't okay. I don't want to be paying that dude forty five plus. But I don't know. Plus. I think it's I think it's time in the situations too. You know what I mean? Mm. Like I think it's time in the situations. Like I think Dak like Dak's floor is like that forty fifty like I, Dak's floor. And that's yeah. I get that. That's what the market is. I I get that. I like just don't want to be paying. That. But that's his talent too. Though. He pro- he's produced yeah. consistently I'm, I'm, enough I'm, I'm, that, I'm, that I'm, that's I'm, that. Dak over Kirk Cousins. I'm not gonna lie to you. I think Dak over Kirk. And I know that's I probably crazy. would too, but it's it's I the think, same thing. I think, Dak can, I think Dak can move a little more. I just think Dak's a cowboy, and your your expectations is so high for that, you know. But Dak can move. Dak makes good throws. Dak makes good reads. Dak knows how to. Dak, Dak is a nice quarterback in the yes. National Football League, bro. Like it's Dak's like, above a game man. Yes, like, bro. Take, I'm like, y'all Dak playing over with Dak, bro. I take Dak over a lot of people. Y'all really Dak playing Dak with Dak, bro. Like. Dak, nice, Minnesota bro. would love to have Dak. Come right on, now. bro. What? Man, like Minnesota get that? They'd be like, yeah, we got what we were looking for. for how like, much? That's take the take for JJ how much? and all this other stuff. But that's like, what that's what the market is for them type of dudes. The market for those type of guys is very high in fifties, flirting with sixty. I don't think they're getting me to my end goal though, so that's why I just don't want to waste my time. But if you don't waste your time with that, who is getting you closer to your end goal? I gotta take chances. So you do Kenny Pickett, yeah. You and the do. odds Draft, are, that and, trade, and let's be real though. Know. But let's be real. You the odds are, out. but what are the odds that you're ever going to actually get to Dak's level? The NFL shows you statistically that you're more likely drafting quarterbacks, trading for quarterbacks to get Kenny Pickett over and over and over than you are to get Dak Prescott. If that's the case, the Cleveland Browns would have been hit the lottery. Let's be real. It took Buffalo how many years to go from Jim Kelly to who? Josh Allen, right? If it's hey. so easy to just draft them, dra- I was up there in Buffalo. We drafted. We paid Fitzpatrick. We drafted EJ Manuel, right? It's tough. Trent, I, it's, Trent it's, Edwards was there before that as here. a former first round quarterback as well. I feel that. Like we can start going. Mitch Trubisky, Justin Fields, and Kenny Pickett are all three former first round quarterbacks, right? That's and cool. all three of these dudes are on very different teams within five years of them being drafted in the National Football League. And you're telling me that you would rather go and play that game than going to pay right. for somebody? That's it. Even to the point, Trey, I think that's Trey, crazy. I gotta try to bro. find the guy. I think that's right, crazy. I gotta find the guy. What's what's, what's what's San Fran? What's Trey name? I'm Trey Lance. They, 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 Trey Lance. They was like, "Hey, well, I found Trey what I needed, Lance. bro. Get a, They thought Trey Lance was gonna be the game. They gave game everything like, up for that one. Remember? They gave everything, everything for that. that. I feel Listen, that. all that the, the all the things you game. just said there is why I was telling Steeler Nation not to take Big Ben for granted while he was here. Fair, fair. So okay. now that we're past starting, that, though, I know I'm starting to realize life without it. So, without, so without a franchise guy like so, that. So, so now you gonna repeat that same 
Uh, that's I, what I'm asking. I gotta find the guy again. I gotta, I, I like, gotta find man, the guy. Bro. And I don't think Dak's the guy. <laughs> Dak's good, but I, I don't think he's getting me to a Super Bowl. I don't think he's winning a Super Bowl. <sighs> I don't think he's worth the sixty million. I just think, bro, we we would be in for a long, dark, tough time, bro. It's like a long, dark, tough. Time. I think. I think the oh, rest might, rest might be fine. Like, you that's, see, that's you see thing, what we, like, bro. We, we might have our answer this year <laughs> with Russ and Field. Bro, I think the answers. part, I think the part you don't see out of that, like I feel you take the chance, but you don't know. Like a lot of people got fired over that. Yeah, trailer. Seriously, bro, coach like, is gonna get like, got. GM's getting yeah, got, bro. Like it's, it's somebody, it's somebody that deals with that Kenny Pickett. They still kind of like, hey, 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 chill. Don't no, you don't talk on this. <laughs> Like, well, that's me. Like that. You know it's Kenny, somebody I, back there like that. I you vote for that man. Good. You vote for. I don't want to hear you say you nothing. That, that was your man. Yeah. When you do that, you gotta wear that. Like, yeah. You know? like, Think about if, if you drafted Zach Wilson, if you drafted Sam Darnold, if you brought in Trey, shoot, Josh Rosen, right? Like, man, you bring something. It's like, hey, man, no, 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 no. You're not gonna stay here. Somebody's gonna go with this. Somebody was a part yeah, of this deal. You're getting something. Yeah. Like, yo, what'd you do? You know what I mean? Like, wait, what'd you do? Like, why'd you why'd you verify this that hard? Like you told me. Because this he was- plays quarterback and everybody goes crazy on the optimism that one of these guys might magically turn into it. But it's like, bro, if your guy turns into that, you have hit it. This is great. If you Man. ever ascend to Big Ben, Peyton Manning, Tom Brady, bro, you have hit the lottery. But the amount of teams that have done that, man, let's I'll be pay real. Him, I'll pay him thirty-five million. I'm on to pay him. I'm on. He, he could, that could be a stealer. You're but trying for to thirty-five million. Ball of on top of that. So no, I just think I think that's a fair market. If Baker's getting thirty-five, I think I, that's fair. I think Dak could say, "I'm gonna go to Cleveland. And I'll show you what's up." I'll, I'll give him a little bit more. I maybe forty. I think yeah, he's a little better than Baker. Deke, but Deke. So my question is this: If Dak was on the Browns right now, what are the Browns? What are they? Yeah. With their roster right now, if Dak Prescott was over there. I don't know. Flacco played pretty good for them last year. Like, if you're getting that play, I'm that asking. type of play, uh-huh. I, I don't know if they're doing much better than what they did last year. Man. Maybe one, maybe one extra win. All right. The Wait. Browns also got a disappointing playoff loss, so that's on par for a Dak season. I think if Dak so Prescott was yeah, you probably get when you got if last Dak year, was bro. with Cleveland, I think Cleveland is viewed very differently, bro. That's all. I think they have a similar season. We can agree to disagree. Yeah. Hi, hi, hi. Whew. It is spicy, baby. It is spicy. TG, man. So, <laughs> we got to talk some more this around the league real quick with you, baby. I right? Still got some more around the league, baby. But, um, <sighs> with that being the case, though, how are we feeling about this? Uh, like I said, if Minnesota were to actually call, because I think that was where we initially started our talk today, too, man. And I didn't get a chance to ask you about it. But with JJ being out for the season now, we obviously know we have two quarterbacks here. Both are capable in terms of Russ and in Fields, but it's looking like we are shifting Steelers-wise to Russ being the guy. All the reports, the way that they've been talking about him throughout this week, and even Coach Tomlin saying that he's going to go out there and you know potentially play four series with the starters this weekend. If the Vikings were interested in Justin Fields because of J.J. McCarthy going down up there, is that something that you would be open to potentially? Wait, so say it again. Say it one more time. So I lost that one. If the Vikings, because JJ McCarthy is out for the year, right? Tore his right, knee up. He's right. done for the year. Sam Darnold's their I've current quarterback. That. If yeah. Justin Fields is our backup, right? Because that's where it's looking like it's going because of all the reports that are talking about Russ from Pittsburgh, right? No, no. You're not messing with that. No. Nah, okay. Nah. What you gonna give me? Well, give, that, me give me. Okay. So if that, it was a third, give me that mute and out wide. Okay. Oh. But no, they did a cor- whoa, whoa, absolutely. Now you don't want to talk. Like, that's how I feel. I'll be like, oh, now you don't want to talk. What about, what about Jordan like, Addison? He said, let me get the mutant out wide. Yeah, let me get that mutant out wide. It seems like you need a quarterback really bad. Like, I got one for They you. would maybe do Jordan Addison for field straight up. I can see that. No, I, I don't, want I don't see Addison. Justin Jefferson. I don't, they're not talking don't Justin Jefferson. <laughs> you, you think he's going there, bro? Yeah, Jordan drives. No, nah, I don't even want to take that shot. But no, nah, I don't want Jordan. Like, hey, okay. yo, I just caught what you yeah. said. You out of pocket, <laughs> I just caught yeah. what you said. <laughs> I don't even want to do that. But like, uh, he said, yo, that's hot I, right now. We can't touch that one. That's hot, hot. Leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Leave it alone. bringing him back home. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> he gonna be um, su- He's way too comfortable now. Definitely yeah, can't bring him back here. Definitely can't bring him back. <laughs> I, 
It's got A B potential. Like, oh no, Deke, they don't trust your man, Deke. They don't trust your man, Deke. Nobody trusts your man right now, bro. That should get crazy. I mean, it, it has been one year in, and he is wilding. My man is outside, yeah. outside. You like, bro? His name came up too but, many between times. you and Rasheed Rice. I'm just like, yo, y'all are y'all just different. Y'all young boys don't care. So yeah, shout out. Man, that's funny. That boy said, "Nah, man, I can't touch that one right now. I'm good on that one." Yeah, uh-huh. I can't mess with that one. <laughs> but Deke was Not saying yet. that the stock might be a little low on it because of all those things. So you know, <laughs> yeah, the stock. Yeah, we need a wide receiver too. <laughs> yeah, I can't go get that one because <laughs> you're gonna have to pay it at some point. Like he's still talented. Yeah, he's still yeah. ways away though. He's only going into year mm-hmm. two. And you could really postpone it because of what he's done in just year one's offseason. Yeah. Be like, listen, bro, we're not paying you till year four and a half. All right. Yeah. Don't even talk. It's chill. Bro. But there's no scenario for you, though, unless you're going for the Justin Jefferson, period. Not draft pick. Would you take a third, I, four fills, a second for fills? You want no. player. Okay. No. No. I need something nice. I'm talking like how San Fran's talking to everybody else. Okay. Okay. Like, give, me, give me give me some nice pieces for this. You need it. Yeah. You need it. I like it. You need it. Big and that's fair. Like, you that's real. Because I looked at you it like this. It. The the way that we're kind of talking about it over here was um, with both Russ and Phils being on one year deals. If Russ is playing, or if we're assuming that Russ is going to be the guy that's going to play well, well then all things should be there. Hey, we're not going to ever see Phils anyways. Right. So. If this is going to be gone in a year, if he doesn't play because, you know, he's on a one year deal, we can get an asset for him, especially knowing that y'all need him a little bit more than we currently do right now because we do have Russ. So that was the part where we thinking to ourselves, like, yo, would that be something that if the Vikings were calling about that, because they're going to call. If they were calling for some of these quarterbacks they called for last year. And it Justin doesn't Fields have to be the, the Vikings. Right. It could be like, say, during the middle of the season, a team with starting quarterback goes down and, mm-hmm. you know, Fields would be an upgrade over their backup and they could have him be their guy for the rest of the season. Like, it, it, it could be like a conversation. I mean, but, yeah. but just from the Steelers' perspective, you're just saying absolutely not. Yeah, I'm not just doing that. You, you do know, a first or a second yeah. though, right? Yeah, I do. Uh, I, 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 and that's if Russ is doing good. Like he, all these scenarios got to line up. Bro, this league too fluent. Like man, like so. What happens if I lose my quarterback? Now I'm kicking myself because I just gave it away for for mm. what? Though? Like okay. what am I getting? Ooh, like what okay. am I? Getting? What kind of first do you even have? Okay. Like you might not even got a first enough to get my conversation right now. Like you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I'm looking for. Like, 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 Justin, I'm looking for something nice, you know. I'm talking to, I'm talking about like, but like you don't we, value him enough to I, say he's your starter right now, though. I don't. So you contradicting it. If you're, but if I'm you another value, team looking at it, I'm like, value, you don't even love him like that. You value, but you value him that. But much. you don't even I, love him. But you do, and I know that. <laughs> <laughs> but you do and I know that. So drop so drop them first. Let me get that uh, type combo. I need that first. Uh, <laughs> and I might need those little second. boy said, I got leverage and you're not my friend. Uh, yeah. <laughs> period. Oh, I don't man. need nothing from you. You oh, see man. my roster. I don't need nothing from oh, you. Man, man. Drop that wide receiver one then. <laughs> Give me that. Like you feel me? Yeah. Like, that, like, that's real. That's real. Leverage move, man. Because it's like, bro, that's a good quarterback. Like, nah, I don't he want is. To Both of these dudes are. All these tight videos coming out of training right. camp were calculated. Like, mm-hmm. hey, he's balling up here, too. So Facts. y'all know, like, Facts. Yeah, he nice. He's don't ready. get it twisted. Yeah. yeah. He's ready for whatever y'all want yeah. to do. Like, what do you want to do? Come yeah. correct. Absolutely, bro. And, it's not, and on top of that, I'm not going to be loud about it. Like, nobody's even really going to know we're having these combos. Like, That's what I don't I'm saying. No whiff of that. Yeah. You know? But like, all of those things that you just said, and because of we all agree that Phils is that talented, if he is just sitting behind Russ, these teams that know they need quarterbacks or if their guy goes down and they feel like we're still good enough, they're going to call. Then call. They're going to call. They're going to call, call. Yeah. We're going to answer. <laughs> Wait, so, yo, I want Justin. All right, all right. What team is this? 
Oh, oh, oh. Who, who's your best player then? All right. Yeah. Okay. I'm, yeah, what do you want? Like, hey, how you doing? Yeah, I'm looking for, I need something like that. You know what I need. Give me that Justin out wide. Oh, you don't want to talk no more. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like, like, you're not asking me for, like, a regular, like, you're asking for, like, this is a starting quarterback. Yo, this man's been a starting quarterback in the league since he walked Come in Come on, there. bro. Facts. Like, what are you talking about? Like, no, we're not just giving, I'm not just mm-hmm. giving that away. Like, I got this. This is mine. And I'm really probably planning on it to be mine for the future. So I'm definitely not just giving it away. You know? I like it, bro. <clears throat> All right. Okay. 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 Well, shout future. out. I like it. As of now, as of now you call it what you want in the future. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. yeah. Hopefully, him or Russ work I, out and we don't have to worry about this Dak conversation or <laughs> drafting a guy. Think, that's that's what I'm hoping for. If, if Russ, Russ could take him. Russ could take him deep in the playoffs. Mm-hmm. Russ could take him to the Super Bowl. I think Russ is going. Like, I think you're moving on. Oh, man. Him. I don't that, nah, I mean, TG, that's tough, bro. If we get Super Bowl, Super Bowl might be a lot. I was about to say, that's tough. Even, yeah. Hey, you get an AFC championship think, appearance, I'll be bro. Real with you. Yeah, this might sound crazy. I still think you're moving on after this is a one year pit stop. Because that number goes way up. It's going up back to 40. You. It's going back to 40 yeah. plus. And if he shows he can do it and do it at a high level again here, yeah, it's going to be 40 yeah. plus. And how, how old is he? Like 36? 36? Yeah, 36, 36. 35, 36, yeah. Nah, man, it's a 25 year old in here yeah. that's running and looked apart and throw. No, it doesn't matter. Yo, let's just do what we got to do now. I'm here for a good time, not a long time. Like, talk we know that. that. Talk. Talk that. Yeah, talk. I, guess it, I guess it depends too, talk then, how talk. the Steelers feel about Fields' development. Yeah. Like, if he man, that's continues why he to develop over the season, right? next offseason. Like I'm sure he could get back in here a little bit right now. Like, yeah. no, we're okay. It's your job. Let's get these reps. I like it. I like how you talking. I get it. I dig what you're saying, bro. Yeah. And, and, if, and these, if that's if that's the mindset, that makes 100 percent sense what you're saying, bro. bro I definitely it's the dig same that. on every position. Yeah. You seen it a different yeah. story. Yeah. Kent Hayward, yo, take a vet day. <laughs> oh, you talk is fight. Don't, don't the vet days. Is, hey, you don't want the vet day, dig. You don't want that vet day. Don't take don't take the day. vet day. Hey, we, we already know what you can do. Let boys do what they're supposed to do. Let's uh-huh. see. Let's hey, hey, look. I, I start seeing Mike kill. Hey, hey, Mike kill. You get these reps. Willie Gay take the vet day. All right. Let's Play. Hey, hey, that like, all right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, Man, you start catching like, wait a take minute. Wait a minute, dog. Oh, no, this don't seem like what you telling me this is. All right. Shout out to TG, man. T- TG a man of the people. All right. If y'all digging how TG be talking, man, y'all hit that like button one time for the coach. And don't forget to subscribe, man. Because I need, because they like, I need to know too, man. Like, <laughs> that boy say, yeah, that's people. the vet day you get, huh? Uh huh. Take the vet day. Yeah, that's real. That's hey, real. Bro, just, hey, I just want you to throw seven on seven today. You got everything else. <laughs> what are we talking? Like things <laughs> like that. Like, you know, bro. You. Yeah. Yeah. I just think it's best business because it's so like you gotta just be on your business because it's, yeah. it's business. It's business. Yeah. It's never personal. Never personal. Shout out never to the business, personal. man. Shout out. Strictly business. All right, all right. Well, well, let's get back to the Steelers business real quick. All right, specifically, real quick. How'd you feel about last week's game? We know you dropped your dope reaction. Shout out to everybody that did watch the homies' instant reaction to the game. He said y'all can expect yeah, yeah, yeah. more of that. All right. But uh, what was your thoughts, though, man? How you feeling? Uh, I thought it was a good, like, first preseason game. You know what I mean? A good sparring match, a good boxing match. First, getting to hit another person, getting to hit another team. Um, ball was just on the ground too much, you know? Like, and I know it seems like, but before the game, I was saying, like, the things you worry about, getting in and out of huddle, ball, snap counts, getting the snap, just smooth transitions. I thought that first unit, just the transitions weren't just super smooth, like, mm. just in terms of everything, the flow of the offense, you know? And it's the first game. It's finding different things. It's finding weapons. Everything's not out there, you know? But just the flow, like, quarterback got hit too much, you know mm. what I mean? Just yeah, that's real. Ball on the ground. Little things like that. Um, I thought defensively, I thought they got, I thought they got worked in the sense of, I thought they played hard. You know, I thought, you know, Houston was able to strike, and that was the ones on ones per se. Like it was a couple yeah. people was missing, but that was good on good. That was a varsity rep, as as Coach Tia called. It. Mm. So it's like, 
I thought they struck. I thought I think that's something to work through. It's good communication. It's good stuff to get on film. Um, I'll be real with you. I thought Kyle Allen balled. Like I thought he played really well. I mean, you said you like know? you were surprised. You know where we got him from, come on, bro. You know where we got him from. Don't do that. <laughs> you know where he come I on, wasn't bro. Don't surprised. Do that. <laughs> But I thought he played really well, like good control of the offense, good command. He was moving the ball. He, I thought he played but, well. But look, like a true half blood, that's what you're telling me. Like a true half blood. I'm with you, bro. You know what I mean, man? Hey, 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 hey shout out to all my half bloods out here in these streets, man. Shout out to all the half bloods out here, all right? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I thought he played pretty well. Um, I thought 41 played pretty well. I thought Peyton played Payton, pretty yeah. well. I know he's the hot spot right now. Uh, that first TFL, that was a no, 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 yes, yes, yes. Like, you go underneath the block. Hey, my boy. I say, Ooh. yo. Nice play. But, TG, that for that to be your first snap on defense and you Man. see it and pull the trigger? If you got the heart Come to go on, underneath bro. the block on your first play, you feel real comfortable in there. You're Deep, feeling good. Your first play, you said, F the rules. F my no technique. Way. I'm going to There's get no it. Way I see something. Oh, play. bro. What? But, but I see what I see. I'm <laughs> I going to get it. I see what I see. But so, I'm yo, not going to on the first play. First play? You ain't warm up to it. You ain't warm up you, to you, it. You thought about this last night. You got you the bus and though. just chose violence. You just... I'm there. I thought he, t I thought he touched Buddy on the sideline on that punt. I thought that was him. <laughs> I thought he touched Buddy. I'm like that was him. I don't know if it was the punter a little bit more, than, but I thought it was him. I'm like he touched it. Yeah, if you, you know. Hey, 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 oh, 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 defense and on tees, my man was productive. Facts. But I think that's what he gotta be. Yeah. Like I think he's the next man in the sense that he gonna have to help on the teams a little bit, and the defense gotta be yeah. hot. You know, yeah. Like I think, I think you'll see fifty in early in the game in terms of rundowns, and I think you bring that in for the pass. You know what I mean? And as it grow, we'll see. You know, yeah. but I think it's definitely it get interesting. It's definitely the hot spot right now. Like you know, like you see that, you know where it's at. I thought he played pretty well. Um, they they, they, they asking him to chat about your boy Beanie too, man. They they asking about your man. And you know, I love Beanie, man. I'm a Beanie guy. I thought okay. Beanie held it down. He okay. didn't play bad. Okay. No, okay. I don't. No, no bust that I seen that was a super bust. I think it was be what you're supposed to be, see what you're supposed to see. Yeah. I think he did that. I think Beanie, I think Beanie will hold it down. No. You know, mm -hmm. he looked like he part of the click, the click in terms of like, oh yeah, that's the next one. Like, he looked like he, he fit the part. Yeah. yeah, he looked like he fit the part. Mm -hmm. You know, like he's aggressive. He's got the dog mentality. He's from up the street, so he's got Mountaineer Nation right mm. behind him. That counts. You, you, you say that Mountaineer blood better than that pit blood, what you saying? Yeah, that Mountaineer blood is nothing like it. I think Mountaineer the Steeler Nation is stronger than Pit oh, the Steeler Nation. <laughs> Enough. All right, we've gone too far. I was like, nigga, got, you gonna let this ride too, nigga? We've, I'm gonna say, we've gone too far here. I definitely think Mountaineer the Pit Nation is stronger than Pit the Pit. That is crazy. I mean, I'm just, I if think you think so. about it, though, he ain't. Yeah, you're not all. But it's kind of like you got to think, man. You've been let down man, in that stadium James for Conner, four though, years. Shout out to James you don't want to go man. through more time. You know what I mean? You've been let down in that stadium for years. Now you want to get let down more in that stadium. Like, it's not like that. you like, man, I'm, I'm done with that. You know? Or you, you go to a game Saturday. Right <laughs> you go to a game Saturday. You see them get blown out. Then you got to come Sunday. You know what I mean? Like, it's just different. Like, <laughs> It's crazy out here, bro. This is crazy. It's crazy. It's just different, you know. So I'm, I, you know, I like it. but I didn't think it was. I thought it was overall it was the first game. Yeah. You know, like you got to think not to be like this, but Houston is a game up on them. Yeah, that's yeah. their second. Mm -hmm. is, they got out there and got some contact. They've got out there and got some. You know, they've got going in a sense. That was the first time the offense got out there, but they've been in a stadium already. Yeah, so that energy's up. It's it's. Man, let's do this. Like you know how it is. So. And your boy Tank Dale, sheesh, he he ain't lost stuff. Mm -hmm. He looked the part. He definitely looked the part. I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, looked you you ain't injured. None of that, none of that from last year or this all season had any residual on you, man. Yeah. No, he looked the part. Yeah, he looked the part. I think you know. That Hunter over there is a problem. Like that defense looked good. You know, I thought CJ looked pretty sharp. Yeah. And you know, Tank, he got shot and didn't blink. Like. <laughs> Facts, like then blink, like hey look, hey look, man, it's it's the that's the year we on right now. You could take a bullet and get up like it ain't nothing, bro. Like shout, it ain't out. Nothing. shout out, shout out, bro. Offense, 
Hey, hey, he Not tougher than me. I promise he's tougher than me. I ain't got that. He tough. You say what you want. That Houston team is going to be a dangerous team, though. Like, I don't want you to think that's a sweet lick. Like, yeah. that's a dangerous team. So, it's like, that's a good team. You know, that's a good yeah. first sparring match. Like, there's more more work to be done. Mm-hmm. They get to leave the trove now, right? Yeah, they had the uh, – they, so, their last practice was yesterday. They had a joint practice today with the Bills. Shout Ooh. out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out. You get no fights out of that? I hey, know hey, they you know, you know they was fighting. Come on, stop playing. You know, they you know it was there. a fight, but 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 you, it, it might it might not have been because the, you know both teams, especially up top, they're, they're they're real comfortable with each other. Sean McDermott, Mike Tomlin, and I mean Buffalo and Pittsburgh are kind of like cousins anyway. So I, I just think that as a whole, like, Dermot said if someone fights, they're kicked out. They're in trouble. Yeah, yeah. And, and Coach Tomlin says he he's not running an MMA camp. He's not looking for MMA fighters. He wants football players. So you know, so we all yeah, I think everybody works together with that. I feel that, but he let them fight amongst each other so much. I'm surprised they don't fight. But this I'm is also you. true. This is like, really like, true. you know how some this teams they be like fighting the fight. Like he yeah. let them fight a little bit to where it's like, man, you know that's what we do. We fight. Like you know? we all afford. If you think about it, like yeah, yeah. every yeah, you right. Even in the season, he'll let us go. Man, yeah, it's because it's, it's, it's company. That's what it is. You could fight your brother, that. but yeah, don't don't let the don't, neighbor from down the street come over here and do that. No, no, no. Don't nah. embarrass yeah. me in front of me. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't care what y'all do Claypool, behind closed doors. I heard Claypool got let go today, but was he out there today? No, nah, he he uh, on uh, he IR. He, he, he on IR yeah. though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he, they say he was in with a toe. You know, it happened okay. in like the end of OTAs, and uh, he was supposed. Oh, to, so he never put that. Rah, he never put the shoulder pad. Yeah, he was supposed to come back, but he uh, never was able to fully get back. So yeah, they went ahead and put him but on IR. Let him go, that means he'll be back though. For them to let him go, well, that, that means he'll be back. Because you know, when you put if you put him on IR at this time of the year, you gotta release him. Otherwise, they can't play for the rest of the year. That was the whole. Yeah. That's that was how I took yeah. the little. You know, get, so get the bonus saying. at the end. Yeah, yeah. You just that's get him IR that's now. I'm, that's shut you down. I'm gonna yeah. let you go right now. Go do your thing. Get go rehab on your own. I see you in a couple mm-hmm. weeks if I need you. But you also Man, know that's a can't. dangerous game though. You he know, can't come back for a certain amount of time. Right. Like they like they they give it a certain. They'll be like yeah. four week injury or mm-hmm. five week. But after that, I think your name gets hot after you come off that IR list. Though. Yeah, it's not like you just dead off of that. Right. Like your name gets hot off of that. Yeah. So you said that'd be interesting, though, man. But yeah, we haven't had any updates about you know what took place in that uh, in the uh, the joint practice today. But we do know it happened. So yes, shout out, shout out. Um, but it'll be interesting though. Uh. Speaking of Buffalo, man, we did see one of them linebackers go down, though, man. Matt Milano going to be gone for a little while, man. Did he? Yeah, tore the bicep. He tore the bicep oh, uh, yesterday in practice. Yeah, he was tackling a, a practicing dummy. Yeah, bro. Is that a steroid injury? No, nah, no. Nah, that's like what Tua had. When, uh, when Tua tore his bicep. Like, it ain't, like, crazy, crazy. But it's long enough, though, that you're going to miss some time. Yeah, I'm just joking. Because yeah. Ray Lewis tore his bicep and came no, back. No, no, no. Ray tore it. What he's he tore? Like he tore his like tri, tricep and something else. Yeah, he was on that funny stuff. I don't know where he got that spray that he had. Yeah, yeah. yeah that and he then, came back in like a month. Come on, bro. <laughs> with, 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 with an arm band on talking about I touched him. I'm good. I just, ah. Like, bro, y'all got to stop with this, man. <laughs> That's all right. Sh- hey, PG, real radio. quick. Uh, do you think the Steelers should bring back Juju? He was released by the Patriots. Uh, I think that's definitely a name to watch. I definitely think that's a name to watch. You know, I think he's calmed down. I think people like that. You know what I mean? What I, is, I, I does he that. have anything left? What do you think he has left? Is he better than the receivers we got? Outside Van of Jefferson, Calvin Austin. I like Van Jefferson. I think Van Jefferson's underrated. I just don't think that's, he got a name per se. That's like what that. I mean. I like think, the routes he was running in that preseason game. What, what I've seen from training camp, he looks good. Yeah, Is he better than Juju you to you? I don't think you can get Amara. I don't think you can just fall in love with them training camp videos, though, man. Because you just don't know. You don't see everything with that. You don't see the bad. You only it's see the, the highlight. Good. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's a, it's a, yeah, it's it's a, a highlight, highlight I was, practice. Yeah, I was man. out there though. I got I got first hand eyes on it. I feel that. I feel yeah, that. Yeah. I feel that. I feel he said that. he said I walked the same grass that TG walked, man. It was one day, but he, no. said, he said I, I touched the same football that I seen TG touch over ben here. Ben Jefferson man. was legit. You know Fields what I'm didn't miss a pass. And look, and Pickens he, was awesome. He, he threw a pass to Pickens, man. You know how he feeling over here. Hey, TG. He, oh, hey. he said, bro, I, I I took training camp. He said, I, I got my reps. And he stayed. Okay. He was the hardest worker at the end of the day. He was the last guy on the football field, too, bro. The last guy. They had to oh, kick man. him off. They had to kick him off, man. 
I totally believe that. Yeah, they had to kick him off. I was throwing, like, yo, shout out to him. Throwing some good passes. I, 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 I could follow for that. Throwing some fade balls. Yeah, yeah you, you had a lot of reps. He, he, he was getting it in. He got it in. I believe in Van Jefferson, man. I think, you know, I think Deke's a different body type. I think they're, I mean, not Deke. <laughs> I think <laughs> Juju. <Drew, laughs> I think Juju's a different body type. Like, Juju to me is in the possession receiver category now, where it's like, yeah. you know, I'm going to give you this catch. You know, you know, I'm gonna give you this catch. Like, I think if you don't need Juju, I don't think you just super grouper, just man, I'm going to grab this. But I don't think, I think it's from a familiar face that you know and trust that it's like, I don't think it's nothing wrong with grabbing it. He and you once too, again, bro. I was just about to say it, it is, but it's not. It is, but it's not. It's, it's, it's humbled now. It's quiet. It's chilling and it's cheap. You get it for super cheap. It's on that Russ, it's on that Justin Fields. Like, we don't have to pay it. Y'all paid it. Yeah. You know? So you're promising me he won't do any front running stuff if <laughs> we're like don't see, I don't ten and three. I, I think that's part of the combo when you bring him though. Like, hey, bro, we. I mean, just a year out, ago bro. he was on that track, but it, literally just a year. Track. I would say just a year ago he was on it a little bit. Like the Kyler Murray deal, like yeah. he couldn't do Call of Duty or something. So like we have Juju deleted social media accounts. I just don't think it's that heavy to you. I think it's kind of like you're not really paying it. You know what I mean? Like, just give me the best you you can give me. You talk, you having combos with it. Like, man, you might be on your last leg. You might want to do this a little bit different. Like, might, you know? might want to be a little quieter. You know, it might be focused yeah. more on this versus that. Like, the combos that. is different. But I yeah, but you say, like, I'm not somewhere. stressing about it, but, hey, something to think about. I, I don't think it's the first option that they're going to go with. You know what I mean? Like, I think it's kind of like, all right. Are we cool? Well, we got, think, do we want to try to grab, you well, know? And I think we would all agree. Option A still is Brandon Ayuk, right? Sure. The way that we've put all this effort, the way the reports have been going. So I don't think that Juju is the first option. But if the Ayuk deal falls through and we're still saying that we want to either add to the position or potentially upgrade it. But that don't mean it's him, though. Like, it's true. Still, like true. Me, they're going to let Michi go in Houston. Like, I'm sure they got a first eye view of that. You know what I mean? Like they're gonna let, like we. I think hold on, we hold on, hold on. You you think Mechie's going? I think they're gonna let Mechie go. But is Mechie better than Calvin Austin? Is Mechie gonna be better than Roman Wilson? Is Mechie gonna be better than Van Jefferson right now? Uh, I think Mechie's better than Calvin Austin. I think they're different skill set. I think okay. Calvin's a deep ball guy. <clears throat> Calvin some deep overs. Yeah. He hit last week on that nine seven three on that mm -hmm. out real quick. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I think that's his game in a sense. Like, I don't even think he'll get that route in the game. I think he'll get the three. You know what okay. I mean? Come get this underneath drag. Yeah. Like I think, I think his route tree is a tree that. Yeah, I think like a match he is better than. You know what I mean? Just okay. a, this route tree that he gets. Yeah, because you, you, you're you're not getting sets. the nine or the seven if we got yeah, this guy and that guy. Yeah, yeah. You get the drags. You yeah. get those. You know, because I, I want mean? GP to do that. I want move to hit me with this one. I want that. To, all right, you know fair enough. Saying? Yeah. Like I think for what they ask of him, I think a different. I think, uh, oh, I broke that tackle is a better body type. You know what I mean? Like, okay. Not that much. He's just super strong. But his game is more of, oh, I broke that one. I'm out. Okay. You know, like his game's not, I'm running past you and I'm old. Like, you know, family guy. You know, family guy. I know how to win. There it is. I know what I need to do. Get, just get it to me right here. I bro oh, I'm out. I can get more. You know? So, you know, I, I'm, I like Messi. You know what I mean? I like Juju for... I don't know. I think that's just intriguing. I think that's a GM. That's why they pay him big bucks in that yeah. moment because it's like, which one do you like more? I don't think you can lose with either one. But, but they, yeah, they both bring very different things too, though. Yeah. But once again, Mechie's way quieter. This is also Juju. true. So but Juju's like, way more proven, though, than Mechie. True. I think Mechie's younger than Juju. This is also true. <laughs> Mechie, Mechie, Mechie beat like heart. Mechie, Mechie, like, he did beat that like, cancer thing, right? Whatever yeah, it was, yeah, he just overcame you that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, sounds like a dog, like, you know. That's so, real. I'm just getting, I'm just getting, like, it's going to be People are bringing up Alec like, Pierce, like, with the Colts, because they oh, got yeah. three receivers ahead of him. Yeah. He was yeah, a second solid. or third round mm -hmm. pick a few years yeah. ago. Fast. Mm-hmm. I don't think that's solid. It's fast. He can run. Yeah, that would be, like, the, the Mechie type. They ain't go get Bart Martavis. From uh, what's his face? Martavis uh, is with uh, which we call it now. He just signed uh, the, the Commanders. Yeah. Man, he, you can't. You seen the Martavis. little video? Did you see the little video of him running? I say, bro, he's still like a mutant, bro. Bro, 
bro. You can't he kill still, my he, D, he, he was running a, a casual go route and pat and go. A little warm up. I'm like, yep, I can see. You can go for 1500 right now, bro. You look the part. He still looks it's, the part, bro. He looks the part. It's tight. He never knows. It's my He looks the part, bro. Yeah. You know? It's it's Martavis. Yeah. <laughs> so Shout out to Tay, like, bro. Shout out to Tay. You know? <laughs> you know? Respect. Respect. Well, like I said, shout out to Tato, man. Hope he does have some success in Washington, man. Get my dog bag right. But um, let's see, let's see. All right, I got like one other one I want to ask you about to just kind of get your thoughts because you want to. When you get on, we get to do this around the league. You know what I mean? Because you're TG. You just kind of like out there. All right. So, <clears throat> just wanted to get your thoughts. We did see where uh Jim Harbaugh, coach of the uh, L.A. Chargers. Oh man, I know where you're going. <laughs> I know. My man going. said he I got, was awful in like, college. I had all them people come at me last year over this. I know where you're going. I know where you're going. I told you. I told you what it was. <laughs> the, day, you, the dance is over. <laughs> this, he said that he, you know, reached out to Kyle Kaepernick and was making an offer yeah. to him to come in and join the coaching staff. All right. Just wanted to leave thoughts with it, bro. Like, yeah, that's it, man. That's you know, I'm not gonna do it because on, on ESPN they said, Well, man, what if he came in as the coach and then they tried to see you? Know, maybe you play eventually, you know what I mean? I ain't going there with you. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I just want to know your thoughts or Harbaugh say, you know, that hey, man, he got a job for him. He's offering it. Yeah. What's the job? He said to be a coach. Yeah. To be a coach. That's okay, what he said I'll to be a coach. Say. He said to be a coach, bro. I think it's calmed down, man. Wasn't Kaepernick at the Olympics? I don't know if he was officially at the Olympics, but I know he was promoting Olympic type stuff for him. Man, I think he said he wanted to do like flag football, at, or something like that, right? Man, you seen him at the Olympics at Team USA's basketball game, man. Like respect, you know. I, and look, look, a lot of people were there. I'm just, saying, I didn't know if you were saying like, was he like officially like, promoting saying, it? Like, like, I don't I know think, if he was like an official think, capacity, but he was there. I, think, yeah. I just think. I say it to say I think we're over the, you know, I think the the trying to use my words the right way. Like I just think the, the loudness around him, the loudness of it has okay. calmed down, you know, mm-hmm. to where now I feel like he could get it. Would he be your quarterback coach though? I don't, he, I don't like, what think it coach? was specified. He just said that they were he was offering him a job to coach, and he feels like he would be an asset to the program. You know, him being in the building. I like that. I respect that. Yeah. I don't know if he's your quarterback coach. Like one, two, three. You know. You ain't digging that either. I, I don't know. That was his game. Fair. You know. You got Justin Herbert out there though. And that's a completely different game. You know what I mean? Elbow up, like little yeah, stuff. Like I don't know. Yeah, the details you know I mean? of it. Okay. Like I don't think I love Michael Vick. Like that's my favorite. Yeah. But I don't know if Michael Vick tells Purdy how to run the offense. You Respect, know? yeah. Like, it's like, ooh, you see it way different. Like, way different. You know what I yeah. mean? Like, I think that's kind of same category. Okay. You know? Respect, them. Respect. Like I said, I just had to get your thoughts on it, man. That's all. You know, nothing crazy, nothing crazy. D, how you feel about it, though? Would you bring him in? You hiring him? <laughs> uh... I don't care. All right. It's, 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 yeah, like TG said, uh, what's he going to be doing? Like, is he is he going to be good for the job? I mean, obviously Harbaugh, Harbaugh has an idea him for him. Harbaugh likes him the most out of everything. Yeah, I'm not, like, I, yeah. I'm not opposed to Colin Kaepernick uh, yeah. getting a coaching job for Jim Harbaugh at all. Yeah, if, yeah, that's fine. All right. All right. Whew. Smooth then. Smooth. All right. Well, the last thing then, because shout out to Matthew Judon getting traded, but we did kind of already talk about that earlier on with everything. Let's talk this matchup, man. Uh, Bills, Steelers, second preseason game, man. What you looking for? What's your, what's your mindset on this thing, man? Uh, just an improvement in terms of everything, you know. Want to see the ball. Want to see the ball stay off the ground, you know, in and out of the huddles. Definitely want to see them score early, you know. Definitely want to see them score early. Play good defense, you know. Love to see a turnover early. You know what mm, I mean? Okay. 
I think that would be nice to see. Definitely for the energy, you know. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Okay. I think that's really going to see. It's the little things. Yeah. You know what I mean? In and out of huddles, like good clean tackles, vice tackles. You know. Mm-hmm. When you see somebody punch a ball out, the little things. Like I think you get the big things. The big things come with play. In terms of you know, seeing like like the the wall plays, those come. But just mm-hmm. the little things, the getting in and out of the huddle, the handoff transitions, you know, uh, controlling the controlling the D line, not letting that truly just get back to the to the quarterback like that. Like I thought the quarterback got hit a lot, you know. So just things like that, finding your reads. I think it'll look better, you know. But do you think there's yeah. anything Justin Fields can do in this game? to close the gap on Russ? Or do you think that ship has sailed and there's nothing that Fields can do in this game to surpass Russ? No, I don't think he can catch Russ. Okay. Not, not, not this early. Like, I think it's Russ's job. Okay. Russ's right, job. I like that. Russ's job. Yeah, agreed. Respect. Respect then, man. Russ's job. I like it, baby. I like it. All right. Uh, I'm trying to think, man. I think that's all I had. Outside of, man, how Flomo looking right now? My nail in the heart of training camp and everything, bro. What's the word? Yeah, it's coming together, man. Just trying. Guys got to get to the ball, right angles, do what they're supposed to do, see what you're supposed to see, be where you're supposed to be. Okay. You know? Okay. The little yeah. things. Focus on the, the details. Things. It's okay. hard to get. You got to get 11 guys to do their job. <laughs> You know what I mean? Not eight, not six, 11 guys do their job. You know? Oh, yo. If, yeah, it's like that sometimes. Respect. Hey, hey, just on a nugget, that Falcon team is starting to build something quietly you, right you now. You see who just signed They're, down there, too. Real quiet. They just grabbed another piece. Justin like, Simmons is down there now, man. Mm-hmm. Dude on in there. Mm-hmm. They already had that other D tackle uh-huh. in there. That, that line getting mm-hmm. thick. Like, all right. All right. Yeah, how you feel about the Jesse Bates and Justin Simmons combo, man? I like that. You don't? I think Justin Simmons is, you know, he's in that Minka conversation. Oh, no, no. We, we agree. We Me and Deke agree. Our question <laughs> yeah. was, like, in the sense of when we saw he signed for 8 mil, it was like, that's dang, bro, why, why yeah. we avoid that? We ain't want to pay the 8? Yeah, that's a letter. Yeah. That's a letter. So that's what had us like, yo, like. Is it because we don't think he could play ball with Mink? Like, we want this combo a little bit better? I think we're I more defined, lo- but Simmons is a heck of a player, bro. I would love to see Simmons and Minka. Nah. I would love to see that. I would like to see that. I think that would have been a nice little little something, something, something. Yeah. You know? I think that would have looked good. Well, you know, here it comes. Like, yeah. Who's going to stay? I think a lot of things got to change, too. You know? So... Okay. All right. I like it there, baby. I like it. All right. Well, man, shoot. We will spend a block with you. And next week will be regular Wednesday, too, man. All right. About to say, yeah. yeah. I'll so, block, you know I'll be saying? here <laughs> but, but shout out to your flexibility. All right. From the heart. Shout out to you, baby. Man, do it, you know what I mean? I'm here, man. There hate. it is. There it is. Love to hear it, baby. All right, man. We'll holler at you next week, though. My dog. All right. Peace, Peace. bro.